All right, so at this point, most of you guys should know the drill. It's been about 16, 17 hours since the Golden Week Dual Dokkan Fest with the new GT Goku and GT Vegeta dropped on Global and JP. And in this video, we're gonna be doing a top grossing update for my fellow Global players to find out whether or not we can expect any kind of top grossing stones or top grossing rewards in general uh, over the next couple of days. All right, so with all that said, Let's just jump right into it. We are on Sensor Tower, and we're filtered by April 28th, 2021, which is today. France is the first region, all categories, and the iOS store. And of course, France is still at number two right now. Uh, they always seem to get to number two for like every major banner, but these are, this, this music and podcast app is always the uh, bottleneck, I guess, or always the gatekeeper, man, for that number one spot. So at this point in time, we haven't been able to hit number one in France, but of course we are very close. So hopefully at some point during the day, we can edge them out, you know, for a little bit and get that number one spot. Okay, moving on, we have uh, the United States, which is at number three. Not bad, but Genshin, I'm not really sure what's going on. In Genshin right now I think there was a major update recently or something like that maybe a new hype unit not really sure it's been a while since I played it but uh, yeah Genshin's number one we got YouTube at number two what are people spending on YouTube oh it must be the YouTube premium or YouTube pro feature uh, I guess I didn't realize that that many people were paying for it but that's probably what it is so we got Genshin and YouTube over Dokkan in the US so yeah, these two regions, obviously heavy hitters, obviously very well-performing regions for Dokkan. But uh, yeah, we don't have any top spot yet. But luckily, luckily, we have the savior of global, Luxembourg, man. And as long as we have Luxembourg, that's all that really matters. Because Luxembourg is at number one right now, up 212 spots. Before I even checked today, I was like, I know Luxembourg's number one. I just know. It's a feeling, like they're just, they always come through, you know, when it matters most. So we got that one region now, and even if no other regions hit top grossing at this point, I think we're okay, because it is a dual Dokkan Fest, and not only that, it's a dual Dokkan Fest on both Global and JP. So what I think is gonna happen is uh, we're gonna get, obviously, some top grossing rewards, and I think it's gonna be more than the normal. You know, normally it's seven stones per region, right? But because it's a dual token fest, I think it's going to be either 10 to 20. Or if we get lucky and we get two regions, then probably 30. If France can actually, you know, edge out, uh, once again, Deezer for that number one spot. So uh, we'll have to see. But I am expecting some decent rewards this time around. And one other factor that's going to play into like how many stones we get is whether or not France actually hits top grossing and uh, I'm not exactly sure actually I have to go check but uh, I think France might be doing okay I'll be right back all right so I just checked and it looks like at the time of filming JP has not hit top grossing which is unfortunate and if they end up not getting any top grossing stones then it might kind of suck for Global too, because we did hit top grossing, but if you remember for the Saiyan Day celebration, we only got seven stones for, I think, Luxembourg again um, on the Broly banner, because JP never hit top grossing. If they did hit top grossing, we would have received probably like 30. So this time around for this Dual Dokkan Fest, because maybe it's a Dual Dokkan Fest, we'll get a little bit more, but uh, maybe not as much as we could get if JP had reach top grossing as well. So uh, yeah, very unfortunate, but it is what it is. Moving on from Luxembourg, we got a few other regions here. Belgium at number three. We have Hong Kong at number four. Uh, Italy at number four as well. Portugal is uh, number eight. Spain, number six. Netherlands, number nine. Switzerland is, I believe, pretty low. Number 16. And then we have Macau, number eight, and Germany at number eight as well. And finally, my country, Canada, surprisingly very high 
for you know our standards, right? Number eight for Canada. The last time we broke the top ten, I believe was. I don't know, man. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. So uh, that's good to see. Obviously, we're not gonna hit top grossing, even though I did contribute a fair amount. I think, like I did, you know, do my part at least a little bit. But it wasn't enough to get us to number one. I'm sorry, guys. I tried. But uh, there you go. So, so far, France is close. The US is close as well. But I don't know if we'll be able to beat out Genshin. And of course, after the first day, it becomes harder and harder to hit top grossing again. Unless it's like a crazy big celebration, like the anniversary. Like sometimes for anniversaries, you know, there can be like one or two days delay for certain regions to hit top grossing. But generally speaking, if uh, you know a region doesn't hit top grossing on the first day or within the first 24 hours after a banner drops, they're most likely not going to be hitting top grossing. So uh, I don't got a lot of faith in the US getting there, but we'll have to see. But as I said, at least we got Luxembourg. Shout out to Luxembourg. We love you. The global community cannot thank you enough. So uh, guys, expect some top grossing stones, but I'm not exactly sure what the number will be. I'm going to say probably between 7 and 20 if we're being optimistic. Hopefully we also get a few other, you know, random things along with it, right? Some orbs maybe, some ties, and even Hercule statues would be nice, but obviously it's not a huge deal if we don't get those. The most important thing are the stones, and we will be getting some stones. So there you go. That is today's top grossing update hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, also hope you guys had good luck on the goku and vegeta banners if you guys missed my stream from last night feel free to go check it out through the link above my head and uh yeah that's it that's all i gotta say you guys are amazing uh if you're new here then make sure to smash that big red subscribe button join the tiger squad now oh and if you liked today's video then make sure to like the damn video hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.